Today I'm going to be showing you how to do this. Basically where I take a compass named test, I drop it, and found compass named test, hold on wait, let me get rid of all that other stuff in the chat, found compass named test. And uh, that that's easy, it just says, say compass named test, found compass named test. As you can see, it only does it when it finds a compass named test. If I do redstone named test, it does not work. If I do a normal compass that's not named at all, it does not work. It only does it if it's a compass named test. I can do whatever I want here. So I can do whatever that is. And then I can clear my chat, drop it, and it says it if it finds it. Basically, this is what's testing for it. And uh, I'm going to be showing you how to test for a custom named item in Minecraft. Um, it looks complicated, but um, it's pretty simple. Uh, it, it, it's, well, actually, when I say it's pretty simple, it's not simple. Um, but uh, anyway, here's how you do it. So, execute, if, entity, and then whatever you do after, is the, what it's testing for. It's going to be testing for an entity with whatever is here. Um, and then if it finds it, then it will emit a redstone signal. Hold on, wait, let me get this. I'm just gonna do it on both, just so, just cause I can, and then I'm gonna move this over here. Okay, but um, anyway, uh, this is gonna be repeat and always active, and right now it's just testing for if any entities exist, which obviously there is, so. Test pass, count one. So there's one entity in this world. Guess who it is? Me. <laughs> but uh, anyway, we don't want it to be testing for me. We want it to be testing for what um, the compass or whatever you want. It does not, it can be whatever. Type equals Minecraft item. NBT, uh, not NVT, MBT equals and then a curly bracket and this is a selector uh hen um hence the square bracket square brackets means selector um curly means an nbt tag pretty much um so in these curly brackets you're going to be doing item colon uh, another set of curly brackets id colon two quotes inside of the, those quotes we're going to be doing minecraft colon and then whatever you want so in this case compass or i can do redstone i'll do redstone just for the sake of this tutorial so that you can see the difference between this one and this one uh this one and this one this one being compass this one being redstone um and then after that um, you want to do a comma, and you want to do item, oh no, not item, whoops, tag, and then another colon, and then another set of curly brackets, and inside these brackets, you're going to be doing display, colon, another set of curly brackets, name, with this capital, that's very important, that uh, all capitals in this are important, so this capital is very important, and this capital over here is very important. So, um, name, colon, um, quotes, bracket, bracket, quotes. Like this. Just like this. Um, and then, after that, you are going to be doing... <sighs> this is where it gets really complicated. Forward slash quote. And then you want to be doing the specific, you want to be doing text. And then after text, you do another forward slash and then another quote. And then after that, you do a colon and then another forward slash and another quote. And then right there, you do what you want, in this case, test. And then after that, you do another forward slash and, and quote. And then that is it. And here, I will just be doing uh, how's it going? <laughs> That's not how you spell, but I don't care. <laughs> so um, now it will be testing for all redstone named. How's it going? 
and I just placed it. With the question mark as well. How's it going? There it is. And then if I take test, it'll do that. And then if I take redstone, it'll do that. If I take this, it turns that off. And if I take this, it'll turn off that off. And then I can just do, uh, say hi. So if I, it'll just say hi right there in the bottom left. It'll just say hi or whatever. You can do whatever you want with this. There's a number of things you can do. So, uh, yeah, that's going to wrap up today's video. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. And if you didn't, oh, well. Um, uh, <laughs> but anyway, thanks for thanks for watching this video. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. And I will see you soon for some more.